The government is fostering a working partnership with South Korea in accelerating development of the creative industry. The partnership is also part of a wider effort by both sides to bolster bilateral ties. President Joko Widodo has met with South Korean counterpart Park Yun-hye at the Chong Wai Dae Palace, more commonly known as the Blue House, to discuss ways of strengthening the bilateral relationship between the two. Jokowi says his administration is focusing on boosting the creative sector alongside South Korea. The president adds the plan covers various sectors within the creative industry, including fashion, film, cinema, and broadcasting. Kami tadi telah berbicara masalah investasi di Indonesia dan Republik Korea sangat tertarik untuk investasi di bidang-bidang infrastruktur seperti jalan tol, pelabuhan, pembangunan rel kereta api dan pembangkit listrik serta infrastruktur di bidang maritim. The meeting also witnessed the signing of seven MOUs for bilateral corporations. The MOUs signed between Indonesia and South Korea comprised of expansion and amendments to existing MOUs on economic zones, creative industry, maritime affairs, sports, peatland management, geospatial data infrastructure, and land administration. Jokowi's working visit to South Korea coincides with the 10-year anniversary of the establishment of the current partnership. In December 2006, both countries signed a joint strategic partnership agreement to promote friendship and cooperation in the 21st century.